Yeah, they call it double vision. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm sure I'm almost positive one of them at EA made a booby joke. Had to have been somebody. Had to have been. I cannot be the only one that thought of that. <laughs> If you haven't already, go check out my new merch store. Link will be in the description. Enjoy the video! Hey guys, and welcome to an overview slash first impression of The Sims 4 fitness stuff. So before I get started, I would like to say that EA did send me this to review for you guys a day early. So that's what we're doing. So big thank you to EA, and let's get started. I will be honest, this isn't the most exciting stuff pack for me. I wasn't like completely thrilled like I was for like parenthood uh that one well that was a game pack but you, you get what I mean that one I was like definitely really excited for this one not so much but I'm still gonna give it a chance uh I would still have bought it anyways with my own money so I mean I'm a sucker for the sims I'll basically get whatever they put out so let's just make that perfectly clear but let's read the little intro. So it's a scale the climbing wall, which I think is like the core of this entire stuff pack is this like moving climbing wall thing. Uh, improve your Sims fitness skills and physique by ascending the all new rock climbing treadmill, complete climbing challenges, compete for the high score and learn advanced bouldering techniques that'll leave spectators in awe. And then it says get fit in style. So I'm assuming there's like, that means there's new clothes. Uh, dress your Sims in athleisure, I believe. <laughs> Apparel that will, uh, that'll inspire them to reach their fitness goals. Choose an outfit from the collection of vibrant tops and bottoms, then pop in some earbuds and hit the gym or wear the new look out on the town. Is there earbuds now? Really? Uh, decorate with modern nature. Now I did watch the trailer, okay? And the only thing that really like sparked my interest was that furniture. It looks really nice. So I'm very excited to uh, kind of get into that. Uh, invite the outdoors into your Sims home with nature inspired objects and decor that convey a sense of motion. Uh, build a spacious fitness studio to watch workout videos or create a modern bathroom space that's perfect for a post exercise soak. So. There you have it, folks. Let's jump into Create a Sim. We'll check out the little uh, fitness outfits that are in there, and then we'll go check out the new objects. All right, I just randomized this little girl in from the gallery, and I always, always forget to check out kids' stuff for um, stuff packs or anything. Pfft, doesn't even look like they have anything, so the one time I do remember there is nothing. I'm um, assuming that means there's nothing for toddlers, but I'll just go ahead and double check. Nope, not seeing anything. All right, the one time I checked, guys, the one freaking time. Oh my. Well, she grew up to be quite a spectacle, didn't she? Uh, we are gonna check this out. So let's see hair. Looks like there is some new hair. Let's just filter through all of my custom content. Let's not talk about it. Oh, there's actually more than I thought there would be. <gasps> I like this. This is giving me some like Sombra vibes. This one right here, Sombra, Overwatch, anyone? Mm -hmm, mm hmm okay, yes, yes. Uh, we have this one, which is a little side pony, very basic, very cute. Uh, then we have this one, which is like the braids, very nice, very nice, very voluminous in the back, like it, like it. And then we have this one, which is the one that was giving me sombra vibes with the purple. It's basically the first hairstyle with uh, some, some color in it. Do they change? Of course they do, they always do. I like the purple though, of course. I mean, it's me, why wouldn't I like the purple? I like that one too. Also purple. <laughs> oh, but I like this one. That one's really nice. Um, I like these a lot. They're like very, very colorful. Alrighty, that one's cute too. All right, so we got those. Those are the new hairstyles. We're gonna go back to good old sombra look. She's even got like matching makeup, really. Uh, now moving on to clothes. It looks like her full outfits, nothing new. We have a new top though, or a, okay, quite a few tops. We have this one. You know what? I actually kind of like this. Hmm. I like this. As far as athletic wear goes, I never know what to put my Sims in, uh, probably because I'm not that athletic myself, let's be honest. Um, but these actually really aren't that bad. I actually kind of appreciate having uh, a few more options because I never know what to pick. So this gives me a few more options. Um, hmm. This is the next one. This is very, very fancy. Like. I don't know. I don't know if I could work out in this. I feel too fancy. I feel like I would wear this out, to be honest. Uh, we have this one, which is what looks like a sweater. It just looks like a sweater. And yes, I, I do realize how how big her uh, her mountains are. We you want to just like take them down a little bit, 
<laughs> and sometimes if they're like too big, it kind of distorts the uh, the design. But anyways, hmm. this is just a sweater, it looks like, or just a long sleeve shirt, I, I suppose. Uh, and then the last one, which is uh -huh. very cool. I like this little, um, this little like tiny sweater. What are those called? I, there's a name for them. I just don't remember. It's really cute. This, uh, this shirt does, does a lot for her chesticles. You know what I mean? It does a lot for them. I think they, they, <laughs> they flatter each other quite well. Honestly though, I think my favorite is still that first one. I, I really like the way this looks like for athletic wear. I think this is very cute. Um, but anyways, those are the I can't speak. Those are the tops. Okay. Let me not choke on my words. Let's go to the bottoms. Hmm. We have two. So there's these. Okay. What? Okay. Now she's not wearing any shoes. And oh my God, what's going on here? Wow. That did a lot. She was wearing a lot of accessories. All right. So the first thing we have is these sweatpants. They're like those fitted ones at the bottom. These are very in right now. I see everybody wearing these. Do I own a pair? No, no, I don't. Because I don't do anything. <laughs> How can I get some when I don't leave the house? Well, I guess there's online shopping. I kind of just debunked my own joke. Anyways, moving on. The next thing is... Oh, this is a, this is a skirt. I thought it was shorts. I have been bamboozled. Uh, it's actually a skirt. It looks like a tennis uh. type thing. You know what I mean? You know, like you're playing tennis. You got like a little tennis skirt or squirt, I guess. That's what this looks like. And I got nothing else to say. All right, moving on. Uh, are there new accessories? I don't know. There are, oh, there's new leggings. Ooh, I suppose she could take these off. Yeah, there we go. So you could just wear the leggings. I don't understand why these couldn't just be in the pants section, honestly. Um, Cause I wear leggings as pants Ooh. very often. I'm sure I'm not the only one. Some people really don't like that though, uh, but I don't really care. <laughs> Do what you want. That's kind of how I feel. So uh, yeah, I'm not going around looking at other people's butts. Uh, so. I don't really care what you wear. Oh, I like these though. These are very cute. I would really, I would like hop on this if I saw this in real life. I love that. Oh, there's different styles. Well, okay, well, let's just make it clear. I like this look a lot. <laughs> For the other styles, there's this, oops, sorry. There's this one. There is one with a little thing, designy thing oh. down the side. Uh, I'm so good at descriptions. There's this one that looks like it was you roll around in some wet cement. Uh, there's this one. Oh, I like this one. I like the colors. I like the white and like the mint green. That's cute. Another one of these. Ooh, this one's cool. It's kind of an, kind of similar to that design I like. All right, all right. Got some of those. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay. So I like these the most. <laughs> Let's be clear. Uh, and then the last thing we have is some shoes. Sorry, I didn't know what this square was. Um, these actually look uh, like custom content, if I'm honest. They look like something I would download. These are really cute. Actually, I'm pretty impressed by these. These are really cute. We don't have ah. many sneakers in the game. Uh, well, I guess we do, but not any that I actually really like to use. Uh, but I like these, these are cute. These are cute sneakers. I like these the most. Moving on to the boys. We're gonna check out the hair first. Uh, oh, they have one new hair. It is the same as the girls. So we've, it's the boy version. Poor hmm. boys. Uh, they always get the short end of the stick. I'm, I'm guilty of it also. I never download custom content for boys. They only do it for the girls. I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. But hmm. don't forget, boys can also have this hairstyle, which I actually think is quite flattering on them as well. And they can have all the pretty colors, just like the goyles, including the ponytail. Which for some reason, all my Sims, like my NPCs in my game, or just like the little townies, I mean, they always have like the most fly looking ponytails, like the boys. They always have the most voluminous ponytails and I'm yeah. super jealous. I don't know what products they're using, but I need to get me some of that. Moving on. So for clothes, they have this top. Oh, this is really cute. It's a little hoodie with a shirt underneath that it looks like, but it's got these little like, uh, almost like shoelace looking things. That's pretty cool. That's pretty neat in an assortment of different colors, which all kind of look the same, but are in different colors. Good explanation. Moving on. We have this. Oh my God. This looks like a spy. He looks like a spy. Um, like cue the James Bond music. Um, this is really cool. I like this. I like stuff like this. Looks like Under Armour type of stuff. You feel me? Yeah. Like this, especially this color right here. This like highlighter color looks very, uh, Under Armour. If you've ever been to Academy, you know, Under Armour. 
It's very nice. I love Under Armour, but I am not about to pay that much for that. Anyways, then we have this, which almost looks like a chef outfit, in my opinion. What? Hmm. I'm not really sure how what I think about this one. I kind of like it, but I don't know if I, like, get it. <laughs> um, I, okay, so, okay. Okay, let me just try to, let me, let me understand this. There's, this is a zipper. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Do you work out in this? I mean, I get, it's got the little symbol that, you know, this one has right here. So I'm like assuming, I don't know. I'm, I'm thinking about it way too much. Then we have this one, which matches one of the shirts that the girls got. Can't remember which one it was. I think it was the last one, but it's basically just a sleeveless top. Uh -huh. This looks like something that boys would work out in. Hmm. Yeah, I get this one. The last one I was, I was a little unsure about, but this one I get. So, oh, 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 that color combination I'm living. Um, okay, so that's what we have for the boys' tops. I'm moving on to the bottoms. Let's see what we got. We got a pair of shorts. Oh, these are nice. Oh, look, look at that little slit. Oh my God, scandalous. Ah. The boys are scandalous. Um, okay, a bazillion different colors. Oh, and it's got that symbol again. I see a theme here. I see a theme. Oh, but not all of them. Some of them are off brands. Oh, cheap route. That's the route I would go. <laughs> All right, so that's what we have for that. And then we have, uh, I th Ooh. think these are the same sweatpants that the girls have. Um, as far as I know, they look the same. They have the sweatpants that come to uh, they come to this little part right here. What is this called? The little uh, elastic -y part. Alrighty, Ooh. and it looks like they also have these same leggings. So if you didn't want them to have pants, they can have these leggings. You can really... You can really squeeze the booty cheeks. Didn't I just say I didn't look at people's butts and like here I am looking at his butt? Sorry, dude. Sorry. Mm -hmm. I've, I've just went in and violated you. <laughs> All right. So now we are going to head out into the world and go check out the objects. This is the part that I'm most excited for. So get ready to hear a lot of, oh, so cute. I'm almost positive it's going to happen. Alrighty, Let's check out the rooms first. These are the pre-made rooms. So we have the home spa. Oh, I like it. Okay, okay. It's kind of like a bathroom. Okay, it's kind of just like a bathroom, but like a little bit fancier. I like the use of the half walls in here. I know that didn't come with this pack, but I'm just saying. Um, okay, I see some new objects in here. Are these windows? Or are these just like wall decorations? Okay, no, they're just decorations. I was like, what? Those are sweet. I wish they were windows. That'd be awesome. Uh, oh, they're mirrors. They're mirrors. I see now, I see now. Okay, so this is also a mirror. Oh, I like this mirror. Oh, this is so cool with the light inside. Okay, that's pretty neat. Okay, okay, uh, I'm digging it, I'm digging it. Okay, oh, there's a new corner tub. I remember hearing about that one. I like this little plant thingy and the shelves are very nice. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. New shower, okay, okay, I'm digging it, I'm digging it. Next, we have a no workout zone. So this is just like a normal room. Plot twist, they didn't put a workout room in here. Plot twist, the plot thickens. Is this a, what is this? It's a new like Ottoman chair loungy thing. Oh, this is really nice. I like the table. Oh, I love these, oh my God. Hold on, hold on, pause. This table is freaking sweet. <laughs> Favorite thing so far is this table right here. I like the new chairs. A new rug, yes, always looking for new rugs. Oh, ooh, this bookshelf is really, really cool. Oh, it comes with that flower on top. I thought they made a, might've, they made of what? They might've put that on top. Oh, I didn't even notice the new light right here. Very nice, very nice. Okay, okay, I'm digging it, I'm digging it. Moving on to the last one, work it circuit. Oh, I get what they did. <laughs> It just hit me that that rhymed. All right, so work it circuit here. This room is huge. So this is a gym. All new workout equipment, except for this, I think. I think that's been here forever. Um, and this is the, the main event for the whole pack is this right here. So we'll have to test that out in just a minute. I'm just gonna, probably gonna go ahead and just leave this whole room here. I'm just gonna put it over there so they can get in and out of there. Uh, and then we'll, uh, we'll check out some more objects. All right, so staying in build mode instead of hopping into buy mode real quick, uh, I see there is a few new things. So there's new wallpapers. All right, so the first one is this one, which almost looks like a sandy beach, uh, if you ask me. It's called Wavestone. Uh, so I'm assuming, it's, I guess it's a stone of some sort. It looks very nice, very relaxing. I assume that's what they were going for. Uh, and then the next one is at one with stone. 
which I believe is the wallpaper in here, which I really, really like, especially for uh, outdoors. I think this would look really nice outside, which is like something that I struggle with so much is finding wallpapers to go outside of the house. Uh, I love it. I love this. Thank God for this. Uh, next is doors. What do we have for doors? Oh no, it's locked. I'm so depressed. And then we have windows. Oh, are you kidding me? They're also locked. How do you unlock these? Oh. Somebody help me, please. My God. All right, so with Jesus Christ, this is humongous. Oh my God. Okay, so we have this giant window and then we have this giant window. Well, this one's not as giant, but okay. Okay, let's just take a look. They have some different color variations. Okay, that one's interesting. I like this one a lot. Okay, okay. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. I've been meaning to build another house, so like this is all like in my interest right now. All the same, all the same. I really like this one. I like this one a lot. I do like that there is like this, uh, what's that called? The like, it's got the like faded looking glass. What is it called? Oh, frosted, that's what it's called. It kind of looks like that. Uh, all right, so that is all for build mode. We'll just, uh, oh, well, let's see if the I can get the door now, actually. Yeah, I can. I'm just, I'm just real dumb, okay? I don't wanna talk about it. I was like, I can't place the door down. Uh, okay, so here is the door. It's a huge, huge door. Same color schemes as before. How big does the wall need to be? Okay, so it can be medium sized to tall. Uh, small walls will not be able to have this door. But it is really fancy. Good for like gyms and stuff like that, obviously. Or if you have like a freaking fancy house. I do like the triangles, that's pretty cool. Illuminati confirmed. Um, all right. Let's hit up these objects. We're just gonna line them up outside. So the first things are these chairs, which I really like. Uh, I like the uh, the like openness of them down here. It's really cool. So we've seen these in one of the pre-made rooms already, but I really like them. And I like that the colors actually reflect also on the bottom. So like you can see it down here. I like that the colors will go all the way down. I really like that one, that one's really nice. So that's really cool. Next we have this, which is, what, is this like a dining chair or what is this? I'm not a, wait, wait, yeah. This is a dining chair. I actually really like this, very weird looking and I, I'm into it. I really like weird stuff. So this is like perfect. Like I, I think that looks so cool. It's just so different looking, I really like that. Next we have this, which is like a little lounge chair type thing. And I love that it has pillows on it. That's something that they've been doing a lot recently and I'm actually very into it. Oh my God, they changed designs, awesome. I love it. I love pillows on things like that, oh yes. Thank you, EA, for putting pillows on things. Oh, we needed it. Next, we have, oh, this table. So I think this is a dining table, and I love it. I love, okay, I, I think the objects are gonna do it for me in this pack. I don't think the actual content of it is gonna hit me as much as the, uh, the objects, if I'm, being, if I'm being completely honest. So this is like a accent table. And you can put like a few little, little things, it's basically just a space filler, but um, I really like it. I love all the color schemes too. I like that it's like wood mixed with stone. Pretty nice, pretty nice. And I think this is supposed to be like metal or something. Just guessing, but I like all these tables so far and all the chairs. I really like this table, very cool. I don't know, I like that it's all very different. I like different type furniture like that. Very interesting. Now this is like one of my favorite things so far that I've seen is this table. Cause I love the glass top and I love the bottom. That is so cool. It almost looks like a freaking volcano or something like that. Like I love it. I love it. It's so cool. Next we have some shelves. I'm gonna pop back over here. Put these on the walls. I do really like these shelves. I like that they're almost kind of like triangle shaped. Well, only on the top, but you know, you get what I mean. I like these a lot. I think they look very nice and like thicker right here. I like them. I like the shelves. I should use shelves more because we have uh, quite a few now that we can choose from. And I think they actually do look pretty nice. Uh, we've come a long way since the uh, base game. But anyways, here is the sink. One of the new sinks here, or maybe the only new sink. Um, so kind of the same color schemes all throughout everything. I really like the light colors in these. I think they're really pretty. They pop very nicely outside at least. <laughs> Maybe indoors it could be different, but I really like them. It almost look, is that supposed to be like marble? Or is it stone? Uh, don't know. These are questions to be asked. This toilet looks fancy. It's a fancy looking toilet. What is this called? The throne world. 
They always have really great names for toilets. Something I've noticed. <laughs> oh, that's the gold toilet. Um, then we have the new shower. Ooh, it's got that like same wallpaper uh, on it that we had before. So it's on the inside too. Oh, I like the detail on the inside. That's nice. There's a drain on the bottom. Maybe I never look into showers. I like the glass doors. This is very fancy. I like this. Oh, yes, I like the shower a lot. Uh, and then we have the new corner tub, which is so fancy, guys. Like if you have a corner tub, you are living it up because I am super jealous of you. And yeah, I mean, there's a few members of my family that have corner tubs and I'm just looking at them. You know, yeah, they've got like the jets in them and I'm like, all right. <laughs> All right, guys, with your freaking jacuzzi tubs. I'm not jealous, I'm fine. Uh, then we have these new treadmills. I like the, uh, I, I think this is supposed to be wood, question mark. Uh, like the themes going on here. I'm actually very into it. I really think it looks really cool. And I like this yellow right here. Not a huge fan of yellow, but I like this one. And we're running out of money, oh no. What kind of, oh no, I spelled mother load wrong. When you can't even cheat in The Sims. Uh, next we have, Oh, I thought this was a coffee maker. Oh man, like somebody please. <laughs> it Tell me this doesn't look like a coffee maker, like a giant size coffee maker. Like the coffee goes in here, you put your cup right here on the little table and the coffee comes out of these things. No? All right, oh, the weights are on the back. Nice detail. Okay, so enough about, <laughs> okay, t that is a coffee maker, come on. Okay, if you don't get what I mean, like, I'm sorry. I don't know what to tell you, but I like the orange. Orange is very cool, but I'm going back to my coffee maker. Anyways, next we have the grand, grand rock climbing wall. Treadmill rock climbing. Also, you know, coffee maker theme here. Um, okay, we're gonna have to see this baby in action. Um, Cause I'm pretty sure I can, I can guarantee you what these animations look like, but this one's gonna be, Oh, we already have one. Never mind. It's gonna be a brand new thing, but we'll we'll have them test that out before we end the video. Next, we have the moss covered stone. This is very cute. I really like this. I like that the the leaves have different colors. That I appreciate. So thanks. Thanks for putting that one in there. And you can see through it. I can see you through the hole. Uh, next we have a painting, which uh looks like looks like a game almost that I've seen before. Oh, they change. Oh, 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 I really like these. Oh, I really like these a lot. Oh, I love this one. How cute is that? How cute? Okay, next we have the mirror that I've seen before. It's double-sided. Very nice, very nice. And all the same color schemes as before. And it looks like there's a light that shines right here, which is pretty cool. And then what is this? Oh, this is a rug. Oh, it's one of those like shaggy rugs. Fancy, I love those rugs. Oh, I like this blue color. That's really nice. Per oh, okay. Quite a few colors and some designs. Yes, I really like that. Okay, all right. I'm into this one. I like this rug a lot. Next we have the, what is it called? Fractal rug. And this is kind of like a curved corner looking rug. Oh, it's got designs of all sorts in it. I like that one. Yes, yes, uh-huh, uh-huh. I'm into it, I'm into it. Okay, that one right there, I love. Uh, whoa, whoa. <laughs> it like freaks my eyes out for a second. Okay, I really like this one. That one's really cool. Thank you for giving us some more rugs. Ode to antique climbing walls. Oh, this goes on the wall. To ant is ode to an antique climbing walls. Oh, that's pretty cool. You can see it kind of poking out. Interesting. I don't, this just looks like a fancy art piece in my opinion. I'm not sure exactly what it's supposed to be. I suppose I could read the description, but. I'm too lazy, if I'm honest. Okay, next we have the booby mirrors. It's kind of what they look like, but you know, I don't judge. I'm into it. I have boobies myself, but here we go. Also, it kind of, you know, I mean, I get I get it looks like eyeballs also. Yeah, they call it double vision. Yeah, mm -hmm. I'm sure I'm almost positive one of them at EA made a booby joke. It had to have been somebody, had to have been. I cannot be the only one that thought of that. Next, we have shine on towel rack. Oh, this is so cool. I love this. I don't know why, that looks like very vintagey looking. I love that. Oh, that's so cool. I really like that. That's gonna go into bathrooms. It's going into bathrooms. I like the I like the cluttery decoration-y type of things. So I'm into it. Teardrip drop lamp. Oh my goodness. 
did they go there? I think they did. Uh, okay, so we're just gonna plop this in here if we can. Let's just make the walls huge again. So we have this one. It's very low, it sits super, super low. Maybe if you had some like really tall walls and like a dining table, you could put this above the dining table or something. That's all I can really think of. Uh, and then we have the short one and the medium sized one. And I wanna look at the colors of these real quick. Cause this looks like a copper wiring, which I do really like. And that's a gold. Oh, the actual like lamp post thing itself changes colors too. Oh, there's a red. It's like a minty green type of thing. Oh, I really like that one, that one's cute. And a green and an orange. I like those. That's a cool light fixture. The only thing with the light fixtures is I like them a lot, but I always like want enough light. You know what I mean? Like the lighting is like an issue in this game and I feel like some lights produce better light than others. But anyways, um, secret stone. Hmm. The stone secret only reveals itself in the dark of night. If there is no more rock or no mere rock, it happens to be an exquisitely crafted light fixture. Its interior has been hollowed out with a surface so thin that light passes through and it makes a glow. Excuse me. Oh my God, it does glow at night. What the heck? Okay, so it looks like pretty normal during the day and then boom. Okay, that's that's pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. That actually that had me going. That had me going for a sec. Oh, whoa. Okay, I'm into it. I get it and I like it. Okay, okay, okay. You got me. You got me. Yeah, you got me. Uh, and then we have the bookshelf, and I think this is the last thing. So I do really like the bookshelf. Very cool. Very weird. I like it. I'm into weird stuff, so I'm liking it. I like all the the color schemes. I like the stone. I'm into it. I like it a lot. I like the little flower on the top. I wish that was an object on its own. Not gonna lie, but you know, I guess beggars can't be choosers. But anyways, that is all of the objects. We are now going to test out this magnificent looking rock climbing wall. All right, so when I click on the wall, there is climb and there's gentle incline and vertical incline and climb overhang. Uh, it's too difficult for her current rock climbing abilities. Okay. Okay. Endurance challenge climb. What is this? She should practice first. Okay, so there's easy and beginner. So let's go ahead and just do a gentle incline. And I just realized I didn't do their athletic wear. Now I feel silly. Mm hmm mm hmm So my girl's got some kind of an amazing outfit on. Amazing. So she programmed something over here. Let's see how this goes. Whoa. Oh, hey, look. It's got the rocks on it. That's pretty cool. So she's not that skilled, you know? She's not that skilled. Oh, okay. There's a light that flashes up here. Got it, got it. So let's just fast forward. Let's see what happens. Is she gonna make it? Do you ever make it? Or is this like an endless loop? Oh, she hopped off. Okay. Is that it? Or is she gonna... Oh, nope. She's going again. Round two. Okay. So I think it just keeps going until she maybe can't do it anymore. I mean, there is like a time limit here, but... I don't exactly know how long it goes on for. We could also do the vertical incline though. Let's have her hop off and let's see if we can do that. She's gonna come over here, program something in here. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Here she goes. She's going up. What's the vertical incline look like? Oh! I think it just stays straight up. I'm pretty sure that's all it is. So the vertical incline is like the normal one. What I was doing was the, the gentle incline, I think. Okay, okay, okay. So, I mean, in all honesty, it's pretty much just another workout object. I'm not gonna spice it up any more than it is. It does this and they get a fitness skill from it. You know, it's just another one of those things. They can challenge themselves. That's a new thing, but um, they do have to get better at it first. But yeah, that's pretty much where we're at with this. That is all I have to say. I've shown you everything that there is to see, except for, you know, when they get really good at this. I, that's all I haven't shown you. Let me know what you think. I personally just really like the objects. That's my take on it. But like I said at the beginning, this isn't really something I'm super fascinated in, so I kind of expected this. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you did, and I will see you all next time. Bye, guys!